Strangely enough, I worked on a steel mill, the largest steel mill in Western Europe. So it was like, a, I felt like I was in the middle of a, a John Cougar Mellencamp <laughs> song or something like that, going off to work in a steel mill. And I, I, it was a type of work life that I didn't want ever in my life. Like the idea of going into that kind of environment, working every day, I found no, I couldn't find sense in it. And I knew that I had to make sense of, of becoming an actor or, or in a, a more expressive life. I had, to, I had to do that. And so I think one of the things that, that has to happen if, if your career isn't explosive at the start is you just, gotta, you just gotta make sure that you're staying dedicated to it, that you make this your life, that you make this, there is no alternative. There's nothing to fall back on. I didn't want to fall back on anything, you know? And how then, do you, how would you describe your, uh, your position vis-a-vis uh, -vis being an actor and being a writer? I think I'm kind of part-time in both, and together they make, they make one career. 